We're sorry, but we'll be taking over this review. I think you have the wrong viewer. These aren't the viewers we want. Oh, I'm sure they are. I think we're on the right internet line. Hi everyone, sorry about that little intro. Just want to play a little trick on you. Okay, sorry about that. Not my best inspiration. Uh, hi everyone, my followers and subscribers, Tanner Duncan here and I'm here to do another movie review of the brand new Disney movie, Wreck-It Ralph 2, Ralph Breaks the Internet. Now I just came back from seeing the movie and I'm going to say good sequel. Definitely worth six years of waiting. And let's get on to this review and Yes, as I just mentioned, it's been six years since the first movie came out. I mean, how many of us were thinking there should be a sequel? I mean, I was surprised they were making a sequel, and speaking of six years, the movie actually does take takes place six years later after the first movie. Now, it had a different... It was a new story. Right after the game Sugar Rush gets destroyed, Ralph and Penelope go to the internet and discovered the internet world while they were doing their work there to make Sugar Rush successful again. And they did bring back all of the original characters and yes, Alan Tudyk who voiced King Candy in the first movie was actually in this movie again but this he, movie he voiced Mr. Knows More. Watch the trailer if you haven't seen it. And I'm sure some of you may have seen the movie. I'm going to say, I would say this is probably the best Disney movie of all time. Not of all time, just one of the best works Disney's ever done. Because the creators before the movie, spoiler alert, said that they took a lot of work to do this, to make the internet live with animation. Who could argue with that? And here's what was cool. There was a line where Disney characters from other movies came in. Like the Disney princesses, those cameos were cool, especially the Disney princesses. And they did bring back all the original character actresses who voiced the princesses, except they had someone else voice Cinderella and Snow White because the actresses who voiced them, their movies passed away, they're dead already. And I want to say this is one great scene. Well, I would highly recommend it. it had a lot of humor, a lot of comedy, and I would say I prefer the first movie, but I would say this one is just as good. And I would say go out there and see the sequel if you enjoy the first movie. Thank you guys for watching this review and sorry about the beginning. And let's just hope this internet thing goes well because who knows? Maybe Ralph might break it. He's not gonna wreck it. Not gonna wreck it. And yeah, please make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. Please leave a comment. And oh, one more thing. This Saturday, as some of my Facebook friends will know, I'll be performing at a Christmas bound con Broadway bound concert for my Broadway solo class this weekend. It's a one night event, so please buy your tickets online if you haven't seen it. No, this goes out to my friend on Facebook. If you can make it, please hurry and purchase. They're $10 each, like I said on Facebook. But thank you guys for watching, and I say hope you all enjoy the rest of 2018.